what's good YouTube today I'm back with another video and today's video as you guys can hear about title I'm gonna be showing you guys like how I edited my Fortnite montage uh in Share Factory on the PS4 and yeah just like I'm gonna be showing you guys all the tips and tricks to like help you guys on making your Share Factory edits and just having the best montage for like your friends for your YouTube channel for yeah for, so for whatever so basically yeah before we get this started make sure to go down and hit that like button I know you guys didn't hit it yet so yeah psh, <laughs> make sure to hit that like button man if you are new make sure to subscribe and use creator code killsxyt I I so let's just get right into the video right now so um first of all you guys want to have your intro you know if you guys don't have an intro it's all good it's an optional stage of this thing so your intro comes first and then you guys can arrange your clips as as how you want it i suggest the clips to be uh maximum six seconds i say for uh, unless it's like a, lo a, a longer clip where you get like a squad wave then it's all right but if it's just a snipe then i suggest like literally keep it like five seconds four seconds my snipe my clips are my sniper clips are all three seconds so yeah that's like a, a quick tip the, to make it like nice and like you all got like a lot, i've been getting a lot of questions how do you make the snipes on beat with the thing i will be going more into depth with that but you, you guys just have to like trim it pop properly to make it on beat and just move the clips around to make it like perfectly so yeah um this is the montage that i dropped um it's called uh it's called um i love by joiner lucas so yeah um Let's just get right into the edits that all the edits that I put in this one because this one was re a really good montage. If y'all haven't checked that out, make sure to check it out. Oh my god, this was one of my best ones in my opinion. So yeah, um, first of all, my intro right here, you know, you just created code kills like YT, man. If y'all don't use it, then uh, I know what you guys are doing. So yeah, um, first here and then right here, like this was just a simple edit. I did not do any. Oh no, I did, I did it. Okay, I split clip on this one. Let me show you guys. What, let me show you guys what I did. Okay, so here, let's play this real quick. If I was you, I watch what you say to me. All right, all right, as you guys can see right when I hit the clip it literally uh, it split and it and it changed uh, filters so yeah right here this is what I did literally um all you guys gotta do is just make the ma like make the split the clip right when you hit the shot so this was like a pump shotgun so as you guys can see I press square split clip press X and I just literally split the clip right when I hit it and this side was the filter all right hold on while we're doing hold on let me just show you guys this first I put the filter at saturate right and then I switched it over to VHS let me show you guys where VHS is. Um, VHS is right retro, and right here, and I made it. And also, I made the like the filter settings like this. This is how I make all my VHSs. And VHS is a really good filter. Hold on, uh, while we're at end this thing, because I use like different filters for a lot of them, I'll just show you guys like the best filters for all your montages. So yeah, first, you guys like uh, let me show you, let me show you guys a uh, real quick one. So there's saturate, which is a really good one. I use a lot. Black and white sometimes. You already you guys already know what black and white is. And an eye grip, an eye glyph. I don't know how to say that, but yeah, you, you guys just gotta edit that and make it like smaller thing because it's too much intensity. But yeah, that one's pretty good. Um, Amber, I use sometimes. You gotta lower the intensity on that too. Dreamy, like, I rarely use it, but sometimes in the odd occasion, maybe. Uh, wind, I use a lot, but I make the s intensity all the way down because if you put it way too high, you can't literally can't see anything. VHS, I already went over it, make the intensity full and the other thing minimum you guys can scroll back and see what i did over there i forgot but yeah those are literally the only filters that i use to be honest so yeah um let's go to another edit that i did this one right here you guys already know i split the clip clip here so i hit the snipe right uh, i hit that snipe i hit him for 150 right there and then over here this was a part which i didn't need hold on i was like <coughs> i'm sorry but um right there you guys i split the clip and i put this into i press square time bender and i just put it into two times and then i split the clip back so uh right here the rest of it so the rest of it was just literally original thing i split the clip again i did the same thing i did on the first one i, I turned it into like another edit i put wind on this and uh i think i put an overlay one sec no i didn't i did it so yeah i just split the clip and put wind on it the filter and yeah that that's that for this one um this is one of the overlay edits that i do so right here original filter saturate right here I zoomed in there and then right when I hit it, it, it switched to a different filter and it switched to a different quake. So yeah, right here, this is what I did. I pressed X, add overlays. I went to an overlay called um, Focus, I think it's called. But yeah, it zooms in and then yeah, that's literally what I did. I just uh, timed it perfectly to where it is and um, right there, you feel me? So I put the camera settings a little bit lower because it, it's going to zoom in too much if you put it higher. But yeah, that's how I put the overlay over there. And then over here, I had another overlay. It's called Quake. I'm pretty sure I made the camera setting a little low because it gets too high. Um, and yeah. I just I just made the camera duration right to wherever I wanted it. See, so yeah, I split the clip. I made the clip different over here. I used amber for this one, uh, and right here you already know I did the split clip thing again. I I use the split clip thing a lot. That's probably my most used edit. See, so yeah, I literally just put saturate over here or whatever filter you guys want, and then just switch filters the second time. See, so yeah, um, there's that. There's this one too, which is a regular VHS one. Uh, 
yeah um so over here this was also another split clip i used saturate over here vhs over here this was another focus and then the quake thingy that i used again hold on let's just go over this again in case you guys didn't know see so yeah, right here i used the focus i made the camera setting a little low uh i just timed it perfectly to when it zooms in and then i zoom back out right when i finished the snipe and then over here i added the quick and a different filter and over here this was something i i tried out i never did this before so i literally press x uh add layout i'm pretty sure i went to default layouts and then not default layouts right here and then right here i used blur i don't know how to say this but i used this and yeah I just really like that, but I lowered the intensity because it's way too high. I'm sorry, yeah, I might have the hiccups, but yeah, I lowered the intensity because it's too high. So yeah, um, that's basically what I did for that. Um, right here, another focus, uh, quake, uh, edit, and yeah, the rest are literally the same thing that I used like uh every single time. So yeah, um, over here I did the overlay thingy again, the blur thingy. Uh, over here I did the split clip again, VHS. Um. Yeah, this one too. I did it. Yeah. So yeah, basically this one was another blur one. So yeah, basically these are all literally the same thing that I did. I didn't even put a filter on this one, but yeah, that's basically the montage. Um, if I helped you guys, make sure you hit that like button. Make sure to subscribe if you guys are new. Make sure to use creator code KillsXYT in the shop. And yeah, that's basically gonna be it for the video. I'm, I think I'm gonna play the montage literally this one right here. If y'all haven't seen it, but I'm gonna like take out the music because of copyright issues. But yeah, I'm gonna show you guys the montage that I just made. Uh, this one right here that I was going going over all the edits that I did and yeah that's basically gonna be it for me man if you guys are new to the channel make sure to subscribe and uh yeah I'm out peace